Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Nammi. So in today's video, I've got another Zara haul for you guys. You'd think I'd get tired of doing Zara hauls, but clearly not. Zara are honestly dropping some really cute pieces for summer 2020. And it's annoying because they drop a different piece literally every day. And you know I have to cop them because I absolutely love them. So I really hope that you guys will enjoy today's video. If you do, then please do give it a like and do subscribe to my channel as I have plenty more videos like this coming your way soon. And of course, do comment down below if there's any other stores that you'd like me to do hauls from or any makeup videos that you'd like to see. So when it comes to summer in the UK, the weather is so bipolar. I mean, one day it can be really sunny and then the next really cold. So apart from the odd heat wave like we had last week, it's never really that hot. So I've got quite a few items from this haul that are really cute with jeans because I always find myself reaching for jeans in the UK and um, that's kind of like my favourite summer outfit and I've also got a few other bits and bobs, some shorts, a blazer and some shoes as well. So just before we get into the video let me just give you my stats. I am 4 foot 8, I'm very petite. Um, and I usually wear a UK size 6 to 8 in clothing. It's usually a 6, um, but if a material doesn't have any stretch to it, then I get an 8. So, with all that being said, let's get straight into the video. Okay guys, so the first item that we've got are these pleated Bermuda shorts. They are in the size XS. Now I really love these shorts because I really wanted a pair of high waisted loose fitting shorts and I just feel like I couldn't find any that looked nice on me. Shorts are not usually what I go for unless they're fitted just because I don't feel like they suit my thighs. I'm still not quite decided about these, especially when you're petite because your legs are smaller. You want stuff that fits you, um, that is closer fitting to your body so it doesn't like drown you. Um, whereas I feel like these are a bit too big on me. So I would love to hear what you guys think down below. Do you think they suit me? I'm not entirely sure. I love the comfort and I love the style and the shape. I'm just not entirely sure whether it suits me, so I'm still kind of on the fence whether I should keep it for the sake of comfort. Um, but yeah, they're such a pretty colour. They're like a vanilla -y colour and yeah, they just look really pretty and I think they look so cute in the summer. So if you're a bit taller, then I would definitely recommend these. So let me just show you how I've paired this. So I've paired these shorts with this wool bralette that's also from Zara. I love how this outfit is paired here. It's just a monochromatic look which I feel looks really classy and chic for the daytime but also kind of dressed up as well. The whole kind of browny mink and beigey neutral tones are just really really nice for the summer. We've got that going on with the shoes and the bag as well and it just makes the whole outfit look really put together. The shorts are slightly too big for me I feel, um, I'm not sure what you guys think but I just feel like they're slightly drowning me so that's kind of the only disadvantage that I'd see but I just love these shorts because I just feel like they're very versatile. Okay guys so this next outfit is a three piece co-ord from Zara, unfortunately this clip actually deleted so I'm just re-filming this bit um, so I'll just give you a long voiceover over it but let me just show you the items quickly. So we have the knit bralette which is in this khaki and this is in a size S. Then we have the matching cardigan which is also khaki and this is also in a size S. And this cardigan is so pretty, it's so versatile, I've already worn it twice just because you can actually throw it on on top of anything and it's cropped. And because I am small and petite, it literally comes down to the most perfect level on me. Like, you know where your top meets your jeans, just around your mid-waist area? I love the length of this. Maybe if you're taller and have a longer torso, it might be a bit shorter on you, so it'll probably come just below the bralette. But if you're petite, this is definitely a winner. And then finally, we have the matching skirt, which is a midi skirt. But on me, it kind of comes as a maxi skirt, but it still looks really nice and it's khaki ribbed again. So let me just show you guys what this looks like on. This is my favourite outfit and uh, 
it's just stunning okay guys so this is my favorite outfit from the whole haul i just love this outfit i just think it's such a versatile piece you can wear it during the day and through the night as well and i feel like khaki is one of those colors that's so universally friendly it just looks good on every skin tone and it just really accentuates every skin tone so it's a win from me um so this is it with the bralette and then here i'm just popping the cardigan on I definitely prefer it with the cardigan on. I love that vibe. You know, the whole knit bralette and cardigan vibe is just so me. The best part is each of these items can be worn alone with another item of clothing and that just makes it so versatile. So I've already worn this cardigan bralette with jeans and it just looks really cute. And yeah, it's just a really nice set. Okay guys, so the next item that we have is this lace bralette. And I've got this in a size small. I absolutely love this colour for the summer. It's so pretty and girly. And it's just a piece that you know it's going to be so versatile. So you can wear it by itself. You can wear it, you know, with a blazer on top. There's just so many different possibilities. And I just think this is something that is definitely a staple. So I'm going to show you guys how I've paired this just so you can see what I mean. So this lace bralette is another staple that I think is necessary for the summer just because of how versatile it is. Here I've paired it with the jeans that I've bought in the last Zara haul video that I've done. So I'll link that down below if you haven't seen it. It's just a pair of these wide length jeans. And I just love this look. You know the two different shades of blue. I just think it looks really pretty. And I love the palette when it comes to the summer. It's just really nice and light. And then it's easy to just dress it up a bit more by putting this blazer on top. That can make it a bit more smart. So if you're going out for dinner... Um, it just look nice to have that kind of thrown on top so you've got a really classy but simple summertime outfit and you could pair this with different colored blazers or even different jeans and you can just change the vibe with just one top so that's why I love this piece okay guys so the next cute top that we have is this really cute organza sleeve top so you've got these bows made from organza detail which you can actually tie yourself and then it's just this really cute ribbed white top and this is in a size small so what i love about this is that it's quite versatile in the sense that if you want to you can change how the top looks so i only discovered this after i filmed um the video so i will insert a picture of another way in which i did it so You've got the bow on the arms, which is the original way in which they wear it. But then what I did is I undid this, because you can. And then I turned it into a halter neck with these organza detailing, which I think looks really pretty as well. So I'm just going to show you guys now. Honestly, nothing beats a good white top and blue jean combo. And this is that, but just a bit jazzed up. So we have the white top with the organza sleeves and then really nice pair of light blue flare jeans. Um, obviously, it would be nicer if the flare jeans go down a bit longer. I just had these tailored to fit my trainers, so that's why they're a bit short. But I just love this top. I just think it looks really pretty and cute. And I love the fact that you can wear it in another way. So like I said, I didn't actually take a video of how I wore it, but here are some photos. So I simply undid the bows and I just tied it around my neck and then left it as another bow with the other two strings on my back. And I just think it's a very versatile and cute top. Okay, so next up we've got this very cute yellow rib top. I mean, it's just a staple that is perfect for summer. It's a very nice v-neck. It's slightly too deep for my preference. So what I will do is I will probably take them to the tailor and then just get it kind of um, sewn up here at the top and then it will be a bit high, which is the only modification I'll make. But I really like it. It was really cheap and I just think it's a really good summer top. So this I got in a size small and I'm just going to show you how I've paired this. It's no surprise that Zara do the best basic summer clothing and this top is no exception. It's just a really pretty light yellow colour. It's got a very nice and flattering neckline and fit as well. It's just nice and it hugs your body really well. Um, so here I've just paired it with these bleached um, straight fit jeans with a knee rip which I like because I don't really like it when it's over ripped. 
and I've paired it with some Air Forces as well. This is just a really nice casual outfit. Okay guys, so this next top is the same as the yellow rib top that we just saw, but it's in black. I just love these basic tops. I just think they're perfect for the summertime. Um, and it, it's just, and it just allows me to kind of, and I just, and I just love it because I feel like they're just so versatile and they're just perfect for summer. So it's the exact same top. It's a size small as well. It's just the black version. So I'm just going to show you how I paired this. Now I've paired this black top with these check trousers which I absolutely love. This outfit is probably one of my favourites. I love wearing you know like a basic top and then having one statement piece of clothing and this is exactly that. It's just really fun and a great summertime outfit. Okay so to finish off the cute tops we've got probably my favourite just because I can't get enough of an asymmetric shoulder it's this asymmetric black bodysuit and it's from the Limitless Contour collection so I've actually bought a few pieces from this collection and I love how they fit so in my last haul, I'll link it down below, I've got the white bodysuit um, and then I also have a crop top as well from that collection and they're just the fit is just amazing, I just honestly love how it just conforms to your body. So I bought this in an excess to S. Okay, so I just want to show you guys what I mean by the rib detail. I'm not, so I'm not sure if you can see on camera. It's just this very stretchy, um, material but it's stretchy in a good way like it molds back to your body it's just perfect it doesn't like over stretch you know those materials that over stretch and then it just stays stretched but this one just comes back to its original shape so yeah I love this top so I'm just going to show you how I've paired this I think we can all agree that an all black outfit is one of the sexiest and classiest outfit options out there it doesn't matter what you're wearing, I just feel like when you have an all black outfit, it just looks really nice and put together. So this outfit is kind of an example of that. You've got a simple asymmetric bodysuit, which I've just paired with these leather leggings, and yet it just looks really nice. The added dimension of two textures also kind of plays into that, so it just makes the outfit have an extra oomph, and it just looks really nice together. So yeah, I just really like this outfit. I think it would be really nice for the evening if you're going out for drinks or dinner it's just a nice put together but simple classy black outfit okay so now that we're done with the cute tops let's move on to this very sexy but simple black dress so it's an asymmetric dress obviously it wouldn't be me if it weren't um, so here you have how it looks on the front and the best part of this dress is the back. So unfortunately you can't really see it on camera until I show it on for you guys. Um, but essentially it's got these two straps on the back and it's just really sexy. It kind of goes to your mid-back level and it's just a mini dress. So um, I will show you guys what it looks like so you can understand what I'm talking about a bit more. It's slightly too baggy for me so I've pinned it on the back just so that it fits me a bit better. So I'll probably get that tailored so it fits me in the same way as when I have the pin on. So let me just show you guys this dress on. I feel as if this dress speaks for itself. It's just such a classy and elegant dress that honestly you need for this summer. You've got such a nice asymmetric neckline but it's a thin strap so it's a bit more dressed up. And then you've got two straps on the back and that's what makes it so sexy. It's just such an elegant and classy dress. And yeah, if you just pair it with some gold accessories, it's just such a nice dressed up dress for, you know, any event. So I have pinned it here where I will be getting it altered just so it fits me in this way. But guys, I could not recommend this dress more. And finally for the clothing, we have this really beautiful linen blazer. Okay, so it's got this one button here, and the waist is actually ruched, so I think you can see it here. 
it's ruched and what that means is that it sucks you in at the waist which obviously we love um, it's just such a pretty blazer I think linen is a must for the summer it just gives you really kind of light casual airy summertime vibes and I love linen for that reason and also this color is very beautiful as well so um, I've just paired this with some biker shorts and my trainers just so that we can dress it down a bit but obviously it's so versatile it's a blazer there's many ways in which you can wear it but because of the rouge detailing at the waist I think it would look better buttoned up than um, with it open so let me just show you how I've worn this so here is the blazer paired with some biker shorts and some air forces. This is a really nice daytime outfit and as you can see you have that ruched detailing on the waist that just really sucks it in. The only disadvantage that I'd say is because I am petite the blazer is quite long um, so that's kind of the only bit that I didn't like but the colour is beautiful and it's linen so honestly it was just such a nice and breathable material to be wearing in the summer. And then you can obviously wear it open with such an array of trousers, dresses, it would just look really good with them all just kind of thrown on top. So this is a definite for this summer as well. Okay guys, so moving on to the accessories. First up, we have this very beautiful hat. This is the hat that I was looking for. If you watched my first Zara haul, I actually bought a Zara hat from there, but I just wasn't convinced. I feel like it didn't look that good on me. Whereas this one, oh, I love it. It's white, it's got the black um, band around the top. And yeah, it just fits really nicely. <laughs> I love this hat I just think it's really really pretty and it's just really casual as well so I'm very happy with this purchase and then next up let's move on to the shoes so the first pair of shoes that I bought so I actually bought two pairs of shoes I love colorful shoes for the summer they're just fun because as you can see my outfits are quite basic um, so I like to have accessories that kind of jazz it up a bit so these are the first pair it's got a black heel and um, they're basically gold oh gold they're basically green satin with this knot detailing and I just think they're really pretty so what I'll do is I'll try them on and then I'll insert a clip for you guys here Okay, and the last pair of shoes are these really pretty blue strappy sandals. Again, such a pretty and vibrant colour. This time the heel is quite short. It's kind of a mini slash midi heel. I know that lots of petite girls don't like to wear small heels because it doesn't do us any favours. But I just really like the style, so I don't really care if it does make me look a lot taller. But yeah, I think it, does, it still does the job of a heel, you know. It still makes your legs look more toned. And yeah, I just love mini slash midi heels. They're just so vintage-y. I love that. <laughs> so these are these. And also, if you have wide feet, like I do, these are surprisingly very comfortable. They're honestly really wide foot friendly, especially the front. If you had wide, if you have, if you have wide feet like me, I would suggest getting a square, um, getting a square heel. So where the front is square toed because it um, obviously helps your toes to splurge. <laughs> so let me show you guys what this looks like on. Okay guys, so we've come to the end of this haul. I really hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please do let me know down below in the comments which item would you guys pick? Is there anything that you like more than the other or anything that you didn't like? And please do give this video a like as it really helps me out and do subscribe to my channel. So with all that being said, I hope that you're all taking care of yourselves and staying safe and I will see you in my next video. Kisses!